Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we will configure a firewall rule using a firewall object as a country group. As we have learned this when we were understanding the firewall objects for the Sophos XG firewall. Just let me take you to the host and services over here and you can see this is a country group. Basically over here there are predefined continents Africa, Antarctica, Asia and so on and if you will see within each and every continent the countries are placed. Coming to the network design over here just let me tell you what exactly we are going to do. This is my client PCs 10.1.1.150 and 10.1.1.100. Now our requirement is that my PC with a IP address 10.1.1.150 should reach to the internet over here but uh, it should be restricted to a certain geographical location only let's take a requirement that my pc uh, should be accessible uh, i mean my pc should reach to the internet and should access only a website which is placed in india location okay rest all geographical location i need to block so going to the firewall Let's begin with the configuration. Very first, we will create a firewall rule. Going to rules and policies over here. I will add a firewall rule. New firewall rule. Name, you can give anything. Whatever you want. I will say client PC12. I will position the rule on the top. Action is accept. I don't want to place this rule in any of the group so rule group is none i will log the firewall traffic source zone will be lan source network either we can configure to both of our workstation but now we will configure only for one pc let's say client pc1 either you can configure this rule uh, using a ip host as a source in the source or a mac host in the source let's go with the ip host for now schedule i need all the time moving on destination zone will be van since we need this pc to reach to the internet over here in the destination network i will be selecting the geographical location or you can say a country group i will just search for india i can go over here and i will apply one select services will be any i will keep it for now we will be creating and link the NAT rule over here. Everyone knows what we need to do. Simply we need to change the SNAT to from original to MASQ. What is MASQ? This is very well explained in our beginning tutorials where we have learned about the NATing and all. I will save this. Web filtering I won't be applying now. It will be none. Even the application controls I won't apply nor the IPS I will keep the policy as blank just we will recheck we have configured the policy with the rule name position on the top rule group none action is accept we have checked the log firewall traffic source is zone is LAN and then source devices client PC1 destination is WAN destination network we have selected a geographical location to be India service is any and rest all we have selected as none because we are not applying any web filtering or application filtering nor any IPS we will save the policy so guys the policy is created now uh, even the policy is created there is something missing which I would like to highlight because uh, many of the time these mistakes are being done when you are applying more over the geographical location policies so let's go and browse the internet and what I will do since I have applied a policy uh, where the land PC one should reach to the website which are within the India location so I will try to open the Mumbai University website It is saying that DNS address could not be found. 
there is a small twist in it now see the rule which we have applied source as lan client pc1 destination van and india there is no issue in the rule but the problem is that in our pc over here if you will see the dns which we are using is 8.8.8.8 if we would have used the dns which is a local dns i mean which the dns which is in the country india at that time this policy would have worked perfectly okay but we haven't used this dns this is a google dns 8.8.8.8 this is the reason this policy i mean the internet is not going through this policy as well as the way we have configured so there is no more a big deal in it simply what you have to do you will edit this policy and you will add the dns ip over here add new if you remember previously we have created one uh, host with the name google dns the same we will be trying to find it and we will add it over here google dns this was the one right so now in the destination uh, with the geolocation as india we have selected a dns also which is 8.8.8.8 .8 if you would have used the dns in dns which is located in india then the, definitely this policy would have worked very well but since we are using this dns 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 which is a google dns this policy is creating an issue now let's go again to the browser over here this policy is firewall rule is updated let's go to the and we will refresh the page and you can see the website started to work now let's try some website which is uh, let's say located in some other country uh, we can try to browse the UAE service provider website which is etasalat.ae okay, this website is opening now Mumbai University of Mumbai website which is located in India location it's opening for you but we are trying to browse at the same time the website which is located in Dubai location and it is not working for you because you have applied a geographical filter for the location India see it's not working whereas this is working for you right additionally I will just clear that doubt as well the one which we had since I am located in UAE now okay what I will do is I will create one more policy saying that I want to browse my client PC 2 this is my client PC 2 which has an IP 10.1.1.100 I need to restrict the internet access within the UAE location okay before that I will be apply changing my DNS setting as well okay this is my client PC 1 right I will go to client PC 2 actually over here I will change the setting and I will say that I will be adding a local DNS now I will remove this Google DNS I will say the local DNS okay I will save it I will move to firewall over here I am going to create one more firewall rule I will add a firewall rule saying that client pc2 to van okay i will position this rule on the top action will be accept i don't want to use this particular rule i don't want to place in any of the group i will lock the firewall traffic source zone i will be saying lan my source device will be client pc 
the IP host which is 10.1.1.100 sorry guys client PC2 which is 10.1.1.100 I will select it schedule I will keep all the time destination zone will be WAN okay over here I will apply a geographical filter saying United Arab Emirates and I will select it services for now I will keep any I will just link the NAT rule you know very well we have to just change this as NAT to MASQ from original to MASQ we have chosen save it web filtering application filtering IPS for now we won't be applying and we will just simply save the configuration So guys, our rule is created for client PC2. Client for client PC2 to WAN. And the geographical location is United Arab Emirates. Over here we haven't added any DNS because we have said that uh, we have uh, the local DNS configured in our machine itself. We will move on to client PC2 over here. So we will open the browser. And we will try to browse one of the I, uh, website which is located within UAE. Let's browse atasla.ae, which is a service provider website. And you can see it is opening very perfectly. Moving on. Uh, let's uh, open to try to open some website which is in India now the same website we will try to open which we try to open in client PC one and you can see it's not opening because we have restricted the geolocation to UAE for this client PC2 policy okay so guys let's understand uh, let's uh, summarize everything in short now for client PC1 we have added the DNS because the DNS which we were using on this machine was 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8, which was Google DNS and this is the reason that this rule was unable to, uh, through this rule the PC1 was unable to reach to internet but we change a little bit in the DNS configuration of the client machine we have used the local DNS that is a UAE a DNS and you can see that from this PC started to work even without adding any DNS IP address so this is how you can configure the firewall rules using the geographical locations. That's all about the policies and rules using configuring using the geolocations or you can say a country group. So guys, thanks for watching my video. If you like my video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and share with your friends. Thanks and see you in the next tutorial.